welcome to Emmett Singh's Mayday Songs. Uh, we'll see how many people show up, and we'll probably start in a few minutes here. Uh, until then, I suppose I'll just fiddle away at a couple different songs and wait for people to show up. Let's uh, see what we've got. Well, hey there, did you hear the news? Sackle worked at Sherman Shoes and said he was a traveling man. Pushed a fish cart with his hands, there's two good men a long time gone. Sackle and Vanzetti are gone. There's two good men a long time gone. Left me here to sing their song. Well, Sackle was born across the sea, some over in Italy. And said he was born a parent's fine, drinks the best Italian wine. Sackle sailed to sea one day, and he wound up in Boston, babe. And said he sailed the ocean blue, and that boy wound up in Boston too. There's two good men a long time gone. Sackle and Vanzetti are gone. Two good men a long time gone. Left me here to sing their song. Now Sackle was a family man. Sackle's wife, three children, and Zeddy was a dreaming man. His books were always in his hands. Sackle earned his bread and butter, feeding the factory's best shoe cutter. And Zeddy worked both day and night, taught the people how to fight. There's two good men a long time gone. Sackle and Vanzetti are gone. Two good men a long time gone Left me here to sing this song I'll tell you if you ask me about that payroll robbery Two clerks shot down by the shoe factory On a street in South Braintree And I'll tell you the prosecutors' names Patchman's Adams, Williams, Kane Them man, the judge with the best of friends They done more tricks than circus clowns Judge Thayer told all his friends all around That he would put them rebels down Anarchist bastards was the name The judge gave these two fine men There's two good men a long time gone Sackle and Vanzetti are gone. Two good men a long time gone. They left me here to sing this song. I got no time to tell my tale. The cops and the bulls are on my trail. But I'll remember these two fine men who died to show me how to live. Come all you people in South Braintree, come along and sing with me. Come everybody out there tonight, let's sing along, let's get it right. There's two good men a long time gone. Sacco and Vanzetti are gone. Two good men a long time gone. They left me here to sing this song. Now I know you all can hear me. I can't hear you, but you know who can hear you? is the ghosts of dead anarchists, and they're angry. So let's wait for it to come around on the guitar again, we're all going to sing along. If people in the next room over from you wonder why you're singing, tell them it's May Day to get with the program. The night is still young, and there's still cobblestones to be uprooted and thrown at cops, so get with it. There's two good men a long time gone. Sacco and Vanzetti are gone. Two good men a long time gone. They left me here to sing this song one more time. There's two good men a long time gone. Sacco and Vanzetti are gone. Two good men a long time gone. Left me here to sing 
this song. Well, welcome to the Mayday concert, everyone. In answer to Mother's question, yes, this is the first song. In fact, it wasn't even on the set list. I just wanted to have some time for people to to get on here. Um, gosh, I had a cup of coffee at some point, and now I don't know where that's gone. But, um, that's all right. That's quite all right. Well, you know, the wonderful thing about Mayday is that it's uh, International Workers' Day, and so we get to kind of pick and choose songs from all sorts of different cultures and, and from all corners of the world and the, uh, the global workers movement. Speaking of which, we'll be uh, fundraising in a kind of a global way tonight. If you uh, want to donate to the Twin Cities Solidarity Network that does work right here in uh, Minnesota, then you can uh, just send me money. Make sure that you postmark that money for the Twin Cities Solidarity Network and not for my tool fund because I did get robbed of all my tools recently. I really don't need much more money for the tool fund. If you want to donate, I'm very grateful, but at this point, you're just buying me nice stuff. Um, <laughs> so you don't need to, but uh, if you want to donate to the Twin City Solidarity Network, you can send me money. If you want to donate to the Bangladesh Anarcho-Syndicalist Federation, that's another great place to spend some money building working class power in the global south. And uh, also the International Anti-Fascist Defense Fund. We're gonna be playing some songs tonight that aren't directly about labor, but are about defending workers from our natural enemy, Nazis. One of several natural enemies, actually, along with bosses and landlords. And yeah, uh, just quite a few things. So <laughs> this song is going to be a uh, English translation. I owe a lot of the translating work to Daniel Kahn. However, uh, we did have a, oh, hey, Sasha Noah. We did have a uh, discussion in the Wooden Shoe Ramblers a couple years ago about some of the uh, translation choices in this song. And, and as a result of that discussion, I uh, translated the, the middle two verses somewhat differently. And given how many of us are being laid off, in fact, I myself was just laid off today, um, we'll be maybe experiencing more and more of a need for songs like this. One, two, three, four, join the marching jobless corps. No work in the factories, no more manufacturing. All the wheels are broken, rusted, every wheel and window busted. Through the city streets we go, idle as a CEO, idle as a CEO. One, two, three, four, join the marching jobless corps. Rent assistance not enough, threw us out, we're sleeping rough. In our stomachs hunger gnawing, thirst around our throats is flying. On a crust of bread we dine, water to us tastes like wine. Water to us tastes like wine. One, two, three, four, join the marching jobless corps. All those years we busted ass, now they put us out to grass. Built their cities stone by stone, mortared with our blood and bone. What do workers get for pay? Hungry, broken, thrown away. Hungry, broken, thrown away. <laughs> Join the marching jobless corps. Unemployment marches on, so we'll sing a marching song for a land, a world of justice, where no jails or cop can bust us. There'll be work for every hand in a new and better land. In a new and better land. Very sure I had around here was my pick. 
which I'm not seeing anywhere. Um, that's actually quite a problem. Well, until I can find it, I might just skip ahead in the set list to a couple songs that I finger picked. Hmm. Very odd. Very odd. Where could that have even gone? Um, well, we're just going to skip ahead to some songs that are finger picked for now. Oh, there's a pick. Hmm. Thank you, Lisa. <laughs> even so, um, you know, no, no, I'll take the pick. I'll take the pick and I'll stay. I'll stick with the sound. It's no use to be changing things around now, much less accidentally hitting my instruments on things. Um, so, <laughs> cool. How's everyone doing out there? Can people hear? Pretty well? Yes, yes, okay. I see the new carry emoticons are getting some use. Yes, I care for you all, all as well. That's, that's lovely. Well, you know, it is International Workers' Day, and so I'm not just going to be um, complaining about uh, about uh, work here. Well, no, I will. Like this song still is still is complaining about work, but it's also about work in a in a more direct way, not about being unemployed. So, uh, one of the one of the first folk songs I learned was in that weird subgenre of Irish construction worker songs. And um, now that I am in fact an Irish American construction worker, I have to play them. It's a compulsion. I don't have a choice. So. Um, it's a certain way that songs of that nature deal with the issue of uh, workplace death that's kind of charming. Alpine and Costain with Vince Patrick Murphy, Ash and Whippy's gang. I've been knocking on the road on my way to draw the dole, when there's nothing left to do for Johnny Lang. And I used to think that God made the mixer pick and hard so that Patty might know hell above the ground. I've had gangers big and tough tell me tear it all out, Rob, when you're building up and tearing England down. In a tunnel underground, a young Limerick man was found. He was built into the new Victoria line. When the bonus gang had passed, sticking through the concrete cast was the face of little Charlie Joe Devine. And that ganger man McGurk said the paddies had to work. When the gasping person he flew off the ground. Oh, I swear, he said, don't slack, I'll not be there until I'm back. Keep on building up and tearing England down. And I was on a hydro dam on the day that Jack McCann got the better of his stammer in a week. He fell from a shuddering jam, and that poor old stuttering man, he was never ever more inclined to speak. And I saw Balls McCall from the big flyover fall Into a concrete mixer spinning round Though it was not his intent, he got a fine head of cement When he was building up and tearing England down I remember Carrier Jack with his heart upon his back How he swore one day he'd set the world on fire But his face we've never seen since his shovel it cut clean Through the middle of the big high tension wires Oh no more like Robin Hood will he roam through Cricklewood Or dance around the pubs in Camden Town Ah, but let no man complain, sure no Pat can die in vain When he is building up and tearing England down So come on, you nabbies bold Do not think that English gold is just waiting to be taken from each sod Or that the likes of you and me will ever get no be Or a knighthood for good service to the heart they have a concrete master race for to keep you in your place And a ganger man to kick you to the ground If you ever try and take a part of what the bosses make When you're building up and tearing England down 
doing out there still yes it's, it's it's a little hard to do stage banter when everyone else is quiet i think other musicians like that i i kind of i i appreciate the distraction you know it democratizes the music a little bit um you know this next song oh hey hey joe lauren jim kathy everyone's everyone's all here it's wonderful wonderful When I decided to throw in some songs against fascism tonight, I uh, realized that I was going to do a whole lot of finger picking in the minor keys, and uh, I realized I had to sprinkle that throughout the entire set list or else it'd just become too depressing, and God knows we don't need that. So, uh, this is the first of those songs, and uh, <laughs> this is actually a, a German anti-fascist song that became a, a kind of resistance anthem throughout Europe, and, um, you know, I was, I was thinking of it today in part because I was looking up the, uh, the Haymarket Martyrs um, and how many of them had ties to the, the German immigrant community um, that came over after the revolution of uh, 1848 and uh, created kind of one of the, the foundations of uh, the American anarchist labor movement at the time. And uh, how then so many years later, um, Germany played host to the rise of fascism How it happens that uh, a single a single land, a single area, what people call a nation, can can give birth to such very different movements. And, uh, and the crossroads that we find ourselves at so often. So, without further ado, Blatting, this is uh, Murzodan. Wide as the eye can wander, heath and bog are everywhere. Not a bird sings out to cheer us, oaks are standing gaunt and bare. We are the peat-bog soldiers, marching with our spades to the moor. Auf und neder gehen die Posten, keiner, keiner kann hindurch. Flucht wird nur das Leben kosten, vierfach ist um Sound de Borg. Wir sind die Morsolaten, sind mit dem Spaten ins Moor. Up and down the guards are marching, no one, no one can get through. Flight would mean a sure death facing, guns and barbed wire wait for you. We are the peat bog soldiers, marching with our spades to the moor. Doch wer uns gibt es kein Klagen, ewig kann nix Winter sein. Einmal werden froh wir sagen, Heimat, du bist jede mein. Dann gehen die Moorsoldaten nicht mehr mit dem Spaten ins Moor. But for us there is no complaining. Winter too in time must pass, and one day we shall rise rejoicing. Homeland dear, you're mine at last. No more the peat bog soldiers will go marching with our spades to the moor. No more the peat bog soldiers will go marching with our spades. To the more. 
Well, well. So bringing it back across the Atlantic over here. Now, one of the interesting, uh, one of the interesting subgenres of uh, labor folk music is what I like to call the "mind closed down" song. Uh, <laughs> there's quite a lot of them, increasingly so since NAFTA. Um, and it's it's uh, the deindustrial folk song. It's uh, kind of about how being exploited. Gosh, that was terrible. But uh, well, this is even worse somehow. And uh, I wrote one of those actually. Really less about the, lo the, the loss of all jobs and more about the loss of uh, an industry that once gave St. Cloud a, a certain sense of identity. So this one's from college. Where the Mississippi water rolls along to meet the sock River bank slopes down over the gray and rosy lawn. Granite City set the sign, granite was a prison wall. But I scarcely met a quarry man in the city there at all. And still the red and broken stone lies along the railroad track. Forty days gone, boys, they're never coming back. Still that pulley gives a groan. Engine gives a roar, scarce a soul. Quarry is stone in Granite City anymore. Oh, the ringing and the blasting used to hammer through the day men went down into the pits to cut the stone away and there were barges on the river and the train tracks that led to the builders in the city hauling up the St. Cloud Red now that red and broken stone Lies along the railroad tracks. Forty days gone, boys, they're never coming back. And still that pulley gives a groan. Engine gives a roll, scarce a soul. Quarry stone in Granite City anymore. Cause that was long ago. Times have moved along. Best stones all been taken, and the industry's moved on. What we've got left here isn't like back then. They've got new machines to do the work of 50 men. Now that red and broken stone has along. Railroad track, glory days gone, boys, they're never coming back. Still the pulley gives a groan, engine gives a roar, scarce a soul, glory is stone in Granite City anymore. Now the drag lines and conveyors rise up high above the screen. Some engineers they're working for the Lockheed Company. And the big box and the strip mall sprout like weeds out of the ground. Pits are all the swimming holes on the outskirts of town. Still that red and broken stone Lies along the railroad track Forty days gone, boys, they're never coming back Still the pulley gives a groan 
engine gives a roll, scarce a soul, quarry stone in Granite City anymore. Well, about this guitar tuning is that you don't need to learn a separate D major and D minor chord. It's modal. You can just do this all day. Good times. Well, I haven't got a whole lot more to say about this particular song. It's another one of those Irish construction worker songs. strong with adventure in your soul. There are better ways for to spend your days and be working down a hole. I was tall and true, all a six foot two, and they broke me across the back. By a name I'm known, and it's not my own, they call me Crooked Jack. Now a gangers blue-eyed boy was I, Big Jackie could do no wrong. And the reason simply was because I could work hard hours and long. I was tall and true on a six foot two, and they broke me across the back. By a name I'm known, and it's not my own, they call me Crooked. Jack. And I cursed the day that I went away to work on the hydro dam. Our sweat and tears, all our hopes and fears, all wrapped up in that shuddering jams. I was tall and true, a six foot two, and they broke me across the back by a knee. Though it's not my own, they call me Crooked Jack. And I see old men long before their time, their faces be lined and gray. I never thought so soon would mine be lined in that self-same way. I was tall and true, all a six foot two, and they broke me across the back by a name I know. Though it's not my own, they call me Crooked Jack. And they say that honest toil is good for your spirit and for your soul. But believe me, boys. It's for flesh and blood, they want ya down that hole. Well, I was tall and true, all a six foot two, and they broke me across the back and by a name I know, though it's not my own. They call me Crooked Jack.
All right. Don't worry, I didn't have McAlpine's Fugiliers on the set list or Finnegan's Wake, so I think we're out of the Irish construction with their songs. But uh, we are going to go on and continue, perhaps continuing through the immigrant experience. Through the immigrant experience, this is a song... It's a song that I played in some pretty harrowing times when good people were taken away by a terribly unjust system. are all in, peaches are rotten, the oranges are piled in their creosote dumps, flying us back to the Mexico border, pay all our money to pay back again. Out of my one goodbye Rosalita, Adios, amigos, here's your say, Maria. You won't have a name when you ride that big airplane. All they will call you, deportee. My father's own father, he waited that river. They took all the money he made in his life. And my sisters and brothers, they worked on the fruit trees. They rode on the trucks till the two sick and died. And goodbye to my one, goodbye Rosalina. Adios, amigos, Jesus y Maria. You won't have a name when you ride that big air. All they will call you deportee. Some of us are illegal, and others not wanted. Work contracts out, and we have to move on. Another 600 miles to the Mexico border, and they chase us like outlaws. Rustlers like thieves Out of my one goodbye Rosalita Adios me amigos Jesus y Maria You won't have a name When you ride that big airplane All they will call you Will be deportees Died on your hills, died in your deserts, and we died in the valleys, and we died on the plains. Died in your towns, and we died in your orchards, and both sides of the river died just the same. Goodbye, my one goodbye, Rose. Adios, me amigos, Jesus y Maria, you won't have a name when you ride that big airplane. All they will call you deportee. That sky plane caught fire over Los Gatos Canyon, fireball of lightning, and 
Fisher all our hills tell me Who are these good friends all scattered like dry leaves? Radio says just deportees Out of my lawn goodbye Rosalita Adios me amigos Jesus Maria you won't have a name when you ride that big airplane Oh they will call you deportee Is this the best way we can grow our big orchards? Is this the best way we can grow our good crops? Fall on the ground and do rot on the top soil. By no name except D forty and goodbye to my one goodbye rose leader Adios Amigos Jesus y Maria you won't have a name when you ride that big airplane all oh, they will call you D forty and goodbye to my John. Goodbye to Rosie, goodbye my friends, goodbye Jesus and Mary. You won't have a name when you ride that big airplane. All they will call you will be deported. Hey, how's everyone doing? What's up? We grew up to 15 people now, 15 people watching. Hey, everyone. Welcome to the show, everyone that's just joining us still. Uh, this is the, the May Day performance. Um, if you want to donate money to worthy causes, please send some to the Bangladesh Anarcho-Syndicalist Federation or uh, to the Twin Cities Solidarity Network. I can take donations for the Twin Cities Solidarity Network. Please, if you give me money, do book at market for the Twin Cities Solidarity Network and not for... Um, the tool fund, I did have my tools stolen. However, I have enough money now that I think we're standing pretty good on that. As some union brothers have helped us out along the way as well. So thank you to all those union brothers and to everyone who's donated. Uh, another great cause that could use your help would be the uh, International Anti-Fascist Defense Fund. Because here at this sing-along, we like our scope of uh, what labor does to be a little more inclusive than just shop floor issues, you see. The way I, the way I figure it, your, your, your work and your life doesn't really uh, end when you punch out at the end of the day, and, and so our workers' associations need to uh, not end when we punch out either. We should be caring for each other at all times, and uh, certainly the boss has tried to outmaneuver workers throughout the entire course of the day. They don't take a rest. I mean, they do, but they hire people to screw us over for them, so. <laughs> they hire multiple shifts of those people. It's called the cops. Uh, <laughs> but this, this is a song, this is a song about uh, irresponsible labor radicals and activists like myself who would lead our glorious unions astray and the steady-handed uh, conservatism, um, I mean realism, of, uh, of our unions and making sure that we really focus on what matters. So. As we go to the table, we will bargain for your pay. But regiment prerogatives, we always shall obey, because management's our milk is this, is this, I'm singing this too low, aren't I? You know, no one's gonna be able to hear the lyrics, and that's too bad, because I really put a lot of effort. I'm, you know, that sound, that scanned it well before, but I'm just gonna change where the capo is, because when you're, when you're a folk musician of my caliber and skill, that's actually what you can do. <laughs> to change the key that you're singing in, it's a magic little tool. Yeah, because I have this, I don't need to learn more chords. <laughs>
As we go to the table, we will bargain for your pay. But management prerogatives, we always shall obey. Because management's our milk cow, and we're drinking at the other. For the bosses hear us singing. Bread and butter, bread and butter. We'll fight for health insurance, and we'll fight to get a raise. But not for your schools or your housing, because we know our place. And demands be on the shop floor, you will never hear us mutter, for the bosses hear us singing, bread and butter, bread and butter. If dictators bust up unions, why should we even care? We'll make a deal to build the tanks they're driving over there until our jobs get outsourced once they cleared off all the clutter and the bosses will hear us singing bread and butter bread and butter we've grown out of rabble rousers we've grown out of union thoughts We'll settle labor grievances with a golf game and a shrug. But pass out one more leaflet, and we'll whack you with our putters. For the bosses hear us singing, bread and butter, bread and butter. to every contract, hold tight to every curve. We'll fight for every worker, as long as you're at work. But once you punch out, buddy, that's between you and the gutter, where the bosses will hear us singing, bread and butter, Bread and butter. Oh boy. <laughs> all right, all right. Ah, you ain't got it. <laughs> I want to be clear that that song wasn't about any particular union. It was about many, many unions. Now here's one actually about a somewhat more awesome union. I believe at least the uh, subject of this song was involved in the USI, the uh, Italian Syndicalist Union. Um, pretty fantastic organization in my opinion, but uh, it's a lot of great great labor history in Italy and because of course there is so much great working class resistance in Italy there's also great uh, reaction by the fascists and the police which is about what this song is about it's uh, it's about an incident where a group of fascists uh, set off a bomb in Milan and uh, try to frame the anarchists for it, which of course the police went along with uh, in full collusion and uh, summarily executed a, an anarchist by throwing him out of a window, kicking off what was known as the Years of Lead in Italy. Which uh, I know is something that nobody here will at all be able to um, relate to or see relevance in their daily life. Um, also, for legal purposes, much of what I'm saying tonight is a joke. So. I 
quiet and long was the setting. How hard that the sergeant was sweating. Brigadier crack open the window. A push, the Nelly goes down. Sergeant Pennelly repeated, I am innocent, but how I'm treated. Anarchy does not call us to bombing. To be free, we must just disobey. Finale confess it Without even your word we could guess it The bomb was laid out by Valpreda Your friend and the blood's on your hands Said Finale the bomber's some mother now my comrades are one of my brothers. The hands stained with blood are your own, sir. Are the ones that are holding your leash. The sergeant leaned in and was smoking. Breathing out and Penelli was choking. Brigadier, crack open the window. Four stories is hard time to do. Flags were black in our morning. Three thousand comrades gave this warning. We swore by the blood of Penelli. We'll neither forget or forget. You guid and you calabresi. Was it you who sent out the order to cover up the fascist murder? Was Pennelli the price in your game? That night in Milan was the setting. How hot that the sergeant was sweating. Brigadier, crack open the window. A push and Pennelli goes down. All right, then. Well, you know, retrieve my capo here. There we go. As long as we're on the subject of uh, old timey anarchists who died horribly, um, yeah, that's an introduction, isn't it? Jeez. <laughs> uh, you know, I'm going to. Uh, Take this opportunity to, to ask people to uh, go ahead and and if you have the money and the inclination to donate to uh, the International Anti-Fascist Defense Fund. Uh, one of the groups of people that's been helped out by them are anarchists and uh, anti-fascists being persecuted by the Putin administration and the uh, state in Russia in a case known as the Network Case. You can read all about it on a site called Repression. And uh, so in honor of them and of uh, all of the 
people facing persecution for their alleged involvement in uh, the group Narodna Samobarona, I'd like to sing Maknovshin. <laughs> Let's see if this can be a good key for it. It was when I practiced, and since then my voice seems to have decided other things. Maknovshina, Maknovshina, Black Army of Ukraine. Oh, you know what? Actually, I see what the problem is. structural damage to this guitar that causes it to have a hard time sometimes at the higher capos, but a little bit of retuning can take care of that, so let's go. Black Army of Ukraine, flags red with our blood, flags black with our pain. Flags red with our blood, flags black with our pain. Like thunder over the mountain, rolling on the plain, our partisans are rising across all of Ukraine. Our partisans are rising across all of Ukraine. In springtime, Lenin's treaties sold Ukraine to the Germans' hands. In the fall, the Maknovshina, like a wind swept through the land. In autumn, like a wind swept through the land. Maknovshina, Maknovshina, Armenoir de la Nopartisan. Ils sont trois de notre peine, ils sont rouges de notre sang, ils sont noirs de notre peine, ils sont rouges. The Nikon's army came singing across the Ukraine where they tread. But the arms of the Maknovshina drowned them in the Senyorka's bed. But the arms of the Maknovshina drowned them in the Senyorka's bed. Trotsky gave us the offer to unite the red and the black. But the hand he gave as a comrade drove a knife into our back. Hand he gave as a comrade drove a knife into our back. They betrayed you, Maknovshina. But though you are torn apart, like seeds cast to the wind, you are rooted in our hearts, like a seed cast on the wind. You are rooted in our hearts. <laughs> hey, everyone. So for those of you joining us just now, that was Maknovshina, song about the Revolutionary Insurrectionary Army of the Ukraine. International Workers' Day, of course, does mean 
broad unity of the working class. But sometimes you do you do have to call people out just a little bit, and that's also what this next song is about. Sing these solely out of pure love of the the rank and file. So. <laughs> Actually, the story of this song was uh, we were once censored from playing a different song, a song that I'm going to play a little bit later. And uh, it was only after we played the song No More Reds in the Union as a way to protest having been censored in the other song that we thought we really should have played this song. Because the entire thing was at an event organized by the Teamsters. The song became more relevant recently after the uh, the last time that they prevented a UPS strike, so. <laughs> Ooh. Yep. Let's go ahead. Welcome all your fellow teamsters and I'll sing for you a song. It isn't very clever but it isn't very long. It's about a fearless leader who will never take a loss. One hand is in your pocket while the other jerks the boss. Oh, Jimmy Hoffa Jr., he keeps the trucks running. Jimmy Hoffa Jr., he's doing mighty fine. Jimmy Hoffa Jr., his partner's in production and making sure there never is a picket. Well, the folks at UPS about a hundred years ago, they said we better let some steam out or the fresh is gonna blow. A good do nothing union is the thing to make it stop, so they invited in the Teamsters to police the shop. Well, Jimmy Hopper Jr., he's carrying the footsteps. Jimmy Hopper Jr.'s doing mighty fine. Jimmy Hopper Jr. went and pacified the Teamsters and that company don't wanna see no picket line. And every time a UPS who tries to stand up to the man, the steward comes a running with a contract in his hand. No walking out, no slowdown, said you cannot go on strike. But we got the dues check off, so we're doing all right. Well, Jimmy Hoffa Jr. keeps the trucks a running. Jimmy Hoffa Jr., he is doing mighty fine. He's keeping wages lower than non union competition and making sure there never is a picket line. In 34 in Minneapolis, there were teamsters brave and true. And they beat the living shit out of the bosses and their crew. National headquarters said no, but they didn't give a fuck. Cause the guys up at the headquarters don't drive the trucks. Well, Jimmy Hopper Jr., his daddy came running. Drove him from Detroit, just as close as goons and he. Jimmy Hopper Sr. tried to crush the local cause there couldn't be no commies in the IBT. Now what would his old dad say from whatever grave he lies? If he could look upon his grafting son with his own eyes. Good job on the corruption, kid. You've taken after me. But you forgot that you're the union, not the company. Oh, Jimmy Hoffa Jr., following the footsteps. Yeah, Jimmy Hoffa Jr., he is doing mighty fine. Jimmy Hoffa Jr. loves his daddy's marble palace. He hopes the rank and file never organize. A <laughs> hey, shout out to Jim who tried to get that other song uncensored. Actually, maybe maybe I should play that one next. I think I skipped it at some point here, somehow. Yeah, I think I did. No, nope, did I? Did I? No, no, it's actually still coming up. It's coming up later. I see, I see. Well, eh, it's topical. I'll do it. <laughs> on my vocal range. Fortunately, my vocal cords are deteriorating faster than the strings on this guitar, so. <laughs> We're nearing the end of our set. I know that I said this was going to go until 10, but I vastly overestimated the ability of myself to keep playing.
Well, that's not true. I can keep playing. I just can't keep playing well. Um, okay, well, well is also a generous term. I'm going to stop after a couple more songs here, probably. So this is a song that I wrote for the uh, commemoration of the 1934 strike here in uh, Twin Cities. Those of you who don't know, in uh, 1934, there was a series of strikes that ripped across America, which again, is something I'm sure that none of you have ever seen or could think about or could imagine. It's not relevant to your life at all, I'm sure. But there was a, what we call a strike wave, right? Where just uh, different industries, different people just kept going on strike because it was a very hard time uh, economically, the Great Depression, which again, I'm sure, not something that's easy for you to relate to. But um, So, <laughs> Uh, the Teamsters in Minneapolis here um, organized across the whole trucking industry and uh, shut it down three separate times, three separate strikes over the course of the year, uh, eventually breaking the back of the Citizens Alliance, which was the uh, anti-union goons who were telling people to um, go back to work. So, yeah. <laughs> Think about that get back to this stuff and this song was censored the uh one of the verses in it had a uh, bit of an emotional reaction from one of the striking workers about uh the real police misconduct of shooting a whole bunch of people um and he had the radical idea that maybe it'd be okay to shoot back um which some years later some people on the commemoration committee did not like that that verse was included or that we would give give voice to such opinions that maybe fighting back was an okay thing to do. And uh, so Jim and some other people, Linda, uh, deserve a lot of credit for, for fighting for us to be able to sing that verse. Unfortunately, they did get outvoted. Um, but here's the original and uncensored song. <laughs> This song's been a hard one out walking on the line. The kitchen and infirmary, they've also served the time for months now. We've been striking the Teamsters and the rest for months now. We've been striking and they haven't beat us yet. So rise up for the union, don't give away to the glow. Can't you hear the marching feet? They're beating out their doom. Ah, oh, hear the young ones crying. Neither sign or pine. We'll see the times get better when we hold that picket line. When first that I moved out here after serving in the war, they said there's room for every hand you never need the poor. But the winner found a stand and asked him work beside the wall. And it's scarce enough to go around to keep a home call. So we'll rise up for the union, don't give away the glow. Can't you hear the march and feet beating out their doom? All oh, hear the young ones crying, neither sign or pine. We'll see the times get better while we hold that picket line. Remember how last winter all the coal men wanted fair? And on that day, way last May, we won the market square. Now they got us in the hole. And they try to keep us down They can keep us in the stockade But they'll never hold the town So rise up for the union Don't give away the glow Can't you hear the marching feet They're beating out their doom All oh, hear the young ones crying Neither sign or pine We'll see the times get better When we hold that picket line Citizens Alliance boys got down them all to hell. Likewise, to Olson's guardsmen and the city cops as well, who shot down us and Baylor out on the market way. I wish I had a rifle, I would give them all the same. So rise up for the union, don't give away the gloom. 
that you hear the marching beat that beat now there do more hear the young ones crying neither sign or pine we'll see the times get better when we hold that picket line the winter's coming fast now and the stores are getting thin each passing dawn that's coming on we're closer to the wind no legion vigilantes, no knob sticks anymore. We'll win ourselves a union town this year of 34. So rise up for the union, don't give away the blow. Can't you hear the march and feed the beaten out there? Do more, hear the young ones crying. Neither sign or pine. We'll see the times get better when we hold that picket line. Well, I think I'm gonna do about two more songs here. You know, maybe maybe if I see a good suggestion, I might go with it. But uh, I think I'm gonna start wrapping up here. Oh, tribute to John Mouse of Albany, the Sartell Mill. I'll try to jog my memory and see if I can remember all the words to that, Mom. And I, I know there's there's one or two lines that I've just about forgotten. And it's in a pretty pivotal moment of the song, but I'll, I'll see if I can do it. I'll think about it as I'm doing this next song. This song here is... Uh, one that I was introduced to by my friend Mark Trias. That's a wonderful translation of it. Mark is engaged in a lot of really crucial work translating old Yiddish music and, and um, keeping it alive, keeping the Yiddish culture alive. I mean, a time of, uh, of cultural genocide and in the aftermath of the cultural genocide that was the Holocaust. That's, that's really crucial work. So big shout out to Mark and all the great work they're doing. Um, this is a translated version that I made of uh, an anti-fascist partisan song called Still de Nacht is Uis Gestern. around the grass is spun do you think darling on summer evening I taught you how to hold your gun do you think darling on summer evening I taught you how to hold Her furs wrapped tight around her shoulders, fingers wrapped on her gun. Her velvet cheeks are red, her eyes are lanterns, watching for the soldier's caravan. Her velvet cheeks are red, her eyes are Watching for the soldier's caravan. A shot goes cracking through the forest. The driver's breast pocket she's found. The army cargo truck was full of rifles. She stopped it with a single round the army cargo truck was full of rifles she stopped it with a single round dark curls hung with snowy garlands morning re 
beeches and trees. Our comrades cheer another victory taken. Our children's future shall be free. Our comrades cheer another victory taken. Our children's future shall be Uh, Linda. Linda's asking, how do we donate to the Anti-Fascist Defense Fund, the International Anti-Fascist Defense Fund? Let me look up, actually, real quick, the, uh, the website, and I'll, I'll post it here in the chat. Oh. Lisa, are you, are you with me? Lisa is going to look up the website and post it in the chat. While she's doing that, I'm going to take a quick look here at the lyrics I do have down for the Sart Elmo song. Oh, that's what those lyrics were. Well, if people, if, if, if y'all are down with me indulging my mother here just for a moment. Actually, I think it's a good suggestion. I think it's a great song. It, it was one I considered putting on the set list originally, and, and then I'd taken off because I wasn't sure if I could really do it justice. shaky but uh, this is a this is a about a tragedy that happened in in Sartell central Minnesota back in oh I want to say 2012 maybe 2013 it was, it was um, not quite ten years ago I was in college at the time and there was a an explosion that destroyed the town mill and there was one man who tried very hard to uh, to set out the fire and sacrificed his life trying to save his co-workers. So I suppose if there's any any day of the year that's appropriate to commemorate John Mouse, this would uh, this would be the day. Last night as I lay in the depth of my sleep, I had an unsettling dream. Cinders and fears, that river of tears, the water of fire still gleam. I fell through the smoke when I woke, the thoughts of my memories filled. So I'll speak and I'll sing of that terrible spring and the fall of the old Sartell Mill. So late into May, on Memorial Day, the compressors were running too fast. And with three machines down, the third one spun round and parched for water. She never would last. She's getting too hot, boys. Must turn her off, fix the pipes. Let her cool down or hide. But with no time to wait, it turned her too late. And 
the fires shot red from her side. It was in those few moments, fear and alarm, and the gas in the pipes began to screech. John Mouse took a stand, with a sprayer in his hands, pouring foam in that fiery breach. Bad fortune proclaimed all his efforts in vain. The fire just bolstered and grew. And the heat sealed his doom. The flames took the fumes. There was nothing a person could do. Now the blash of the streets and the flames lick the sky. The paper rained over the town. A column of smoke rose higher and higher and was seen three counties around. And the sirens and bells made a funeral knell. And the engine stood over the shore. And in cinder and smoke, the sepitaph wrote, There's no mill in Sartell anymore. I can see the new workmen are taking her down. As I stand by the river bank ice, the junker machines and they tear down her walls. Salvaged at scrap metal price. And though she stood on the shore for a century or more, now they're tearing her down by the day. Two hundred fifty souls are fresh on the dole. One's gone and passed on away. So may God cast his love. On the soul of John Mouse, the town of Albany. He died trying to save all those workers beside him, feeding his family. For his children and wife, he gave up his life, so we remember him still. And we'll lay him to rest with the bravest and the best, far from that old Sartell. Huh. Well, you know that that is. That is also a, a great request there, Mom. I, I'd be willing to play that one as well, actually. So one I was thinking of playing the other day. Um, the name of the song is Jane Doe. I'll play that on the other guitar if I'm going to do that. We are nearing the end of the set list, but my mother keeps requesting songs and I keep playing them. So. There we go. Uh, in answer to Aisha's questions, uh, yes, this entire live stream will still be available when I'm done playing and. Uh, I am taking request. Uh, I've been playing for about an hour and 20 minutes, only about a third of which has been me talking. So <laughs> I'm taking a few more requests, maybe. But eventually, we're going to have to call this a night, play the Internationale, and uh, go on to do whatever riotous activities we have planned for the evening. So. Uh, 
Oh yeah, also we'll be playing Solidarity forever. this song to the uh, indigenous women of northern Minnesota, especially those who are working to end sex trafficking operations, other forms of human trafficking. I also want to dedicate it to uh, all the sex worker organizers who are working to end exploitation as much as they can in that industry and in sex in general. Street, laid out on the table, wrapped up in a sheet. They took down her number without any name. Woman lay murdered and none were to blame. In the North Reservation, there's a chill in the air. On the faces are heavy with care, and the pain in your belly pounds hard on your brain. Whiskey's like poison rum, thick in the veins of men with money who come out to play. Driving up from the harbor to find out their prey. With presents and promises in young girls' ears. There's more on the docks than you'll ever get here. And Duluth rusts away by the waves and the heights. And the drunks take the streets in the red neon lights. And the night sinks the sun and the lake turns to black. Way out past the harbor and the tack of night stacks. And the girls stand cold by the skeleton cave. And they wait for the freight liners off Thunder Bay. Cross get Chigumi, they make for the shore. By the red women and the red iron ore. Harbor horns screaming and the freighter boat lands. The dollars and the women, they're all changing hands. And the sailors buy in where their money is right. To play the great settler night after night. It's been said, and I think it's true. That colony days never died in Duluth. For 300 years they've been bargained and sold. The soldier, the logger, and the iron boat hold. By the needle, they've been killed by the knife. Cut down so low that they took their own life. They've been put on this earth in a bed made of thorns. They've been sentenced to die since the day they were born. Requests here. Looking, looking at these requests. Um, ooh, uh, a Joe Hill song. Yeah, I could do a Joe Hill song. I could do a Joe Hill song. Hmm? 
This is one that I used to play in the uh, punk houses in St. Cloud a lot. I think it uh, still holds some relevance. Uh, maybe, maybe I'll add in a verse or two if I feel like it. Long-haired preachers come out every night Try to tell you what's wrong and what's right But when asked about something to eat They will answer in voices so sweet You will eat by and by In that glorious land above the sky Work and pray Live on hay, you'll get pie in the sky when you die. We can shout at these. <laughs> Holy rollers and jumpers come out, and they sing and they clap and they shout. In your money to Jesus, they say, He will cure all diseases today. You will eat by and by In that glorious land above the sky Work and pray and live on hay You'll get pie in the sky when you die That's a lie Well, that starvation army, they pray And they sing and they clap and they pray and they get all your coin on the drum And they tell you when you're on the bum You will eat by and by In that glorious land above the sky Work and pray, live on hay You'll get pie in the sky when you die Well, you fight hard for your kids, husband or wife Try to get something good in this life You're a sinner and a bad man, they'll tell You will die and are bound straight for hell You will eat by and by From that glorious land above the sky Work and pray and live on hay You'll get pie in the sky when you die See if I can remember that verse I wrote. Long haired yogis, they'll come out every night. They'll try to line up all your chakras just right. But when asked about making some change, they will give you an answer so strange. You will eat by and by from that land behind your inner eye. Meditate. Don't agitate, change will come with artisanal chai. Okay. Working folk of all countries unite. Side by side, we both greed on the fight. When the world and its wealth we have gained, to the drafters we'll sing this refrain. You will lead by and by When you learn how to cook and how to fry Chop some wood, it'll do you good And you'll eat in the sweet by and by That's no lie! Mmm! <laughs> not a song that's just me um, doing stuff uh you know what i will do that song that we skipped earlier this is the, the show that never ends and i'm not gonna let it end yet so let's see what i can butcher on this
Interesting proposition there. Interesting proposition to be had. Number one. So this is a song about one of the uh, more exciting and more militant new labor tactics that's been happening in recent years. The uh, blockading of trains filled with coal by miners that aren't getting their severance payment. These uh, coal companies like to cut and run and they like to leave uh, the communities, the miners, without their pay after uh, declaring bankruptcy. and. Uh, so miners have been keeping that coal in the ground until they get what they're owed. This is the maybe first song I played, first time I played the song in public. And those of you who stayed this far, well, you don't seem to be going anywhere, so. <laughs> back in the box for now. Let's put that one back in the box and just move on to our regularly scheduled programming. I, I made a perhaps fatal mistake in which key that's going to be in and it will probably take a little while to figure out which key that's going to work in. It's, it's not going to work out tonight. No, we're going we're to move towards the end game here. That's what we're going to do tonight. <laughs> All right. I go through this song. Would you mind um, scrolling down for me? Are necessary? Let me do this. of starvation Arise you wretched of the earth For justice thunders condemnation And a better world's in birth No more hunger's chain shall bind us Arise you slaves no more in thrall The earth shall rise on new foundations we have been not, we shall be all. So come comrades, come and rally, and the last fight let us face. The international unites the human race. So come comrades, come and rally, and the last fight let us face. The international unites the human race. We want no condescending saviors to rule us from their judgment hall. 
be workers, ask not for their favors. Let us consult for all. Do end the reign of exploitation and to give to all a happy lot. We'll ignite revolt in every nation and we'll strike while the iron is hot. So come comrades, come and rally and the last fight let us face the internationale unites the human race so come comrades come and rally and the last fight let us face the internationale unites the human race no army march upon another no war but class war shall we fight oh wait no that's not how it goes yes let no one build walls to divide us no war but class war shall we fight come greet the dawn and stand beside us Workers of the world unite. Let no army march upon another. Throw down your medals, throw down your swords. Embrace as sisters and as brothers. We'll turn our arms upon our lords. So come, comrades, come and rally. And the last fight let us face. The internationale. The human race, so oh, come, comrades, come and rally, and the last fight let us face. The internationale unites the human race. And now begins the final drama in the streets and in the fields. We will stand on bow before their armor. We'll defy their guns and steel. As we fight and weather their oppression, let us be inspired by life and love. For though they offer us concessions, change will not come from So come, comrades, and rally, and the last fight let us face. The internationale unites the human race. So come, comrades, come and rally, and this is the time and the place. The internationale unites the human race.
Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, in, in response to Aisha, yes, uh, you could definitely do uh, that last verse. Embrace as sisters and as brothers. Um, hmm. Well, I could I could rewrite it to be gender neutral. There are there are several um, more gender neutral versions than that. Um, so yes, uh, if you want, I'll actually send you uh, a gender neutral rewrite of that verse. In fact, I'll send you my translation. That is that is a translation that I personally made. Um, it incorporates several other ones, the American, uh, the English, the uh, Billy Bragg version. So um, definitely it can be modified, absolutely. Well, I'm, I'm thinking we're just about done here tonight. I'm not quite sure. Oh, there it is. Here's a capo. That's going to be a little too high for me. All right. All right, let's uh, let's do the the last song of the night here. We're gonna do Solidarity Forever. When the union's inspiration through the workers' blood shall run, there can be no power greater anywhere beneath the sun. Yet what force on earth is weaker? strength of one for the union makes us strong. Solidarity forever. Solidarity forever. Solidarity forever for the union makes us strong. Is there aught we hold in common with the greedy parasite? Who would lash us into serfdom and would crush us with their might? Is there anything left to us but to organize and fight? The union makes us strong. Solidarity forever. Solidarity forever. Solidarity forever. For the union makes us strong. Plow the prairies, built the cities where they trade, dug the mines and built the workshops, and less miles of railroad laid. Now we stand outcast and starving, miss the wonders we have made, but the union makes us strong. Solidarity forever, solidarity forever, solidarity forever. For the union makes us strong. and ours alone. We have laid the wide foundations of the skyward stone by stone. It is ours not just to slave in, but to master and to own. The union makes us strong. Solidarity forever. Solidarity forever. Solidarity forever. For the union makes us strong. 
have taken untold millions that they never toil to earn. Without our brain and muscle, not a single wheel can turn. We can break their haughty power, gain our freedom when we learn that the union makes us strong. Solidarity forever. Solidarity forever. Solidarity forever. For the union makes us strong. In our hands is placed a power greater than their hoarded gold, greater than the might of armies magnified a thousandfold. We can bring to birth a new world from the ashes of the old when the union makes us strong. Solidarity forever. Solidarity forever. Solidarity forever, for the union makes us strong. All right, thank you. Well, that's our show. Uh, thank you all so much for coming in, and happy May Day. Uh, solidarity to all of you and all your struggles in the years ahead. And uh, yeah, let's get through it together. Don't cross picket lines. Thanks. <laughs>